Hey YouTube, it's me, your girl Lena, and I'm back with finally my IMATS haul video. Um, I know my lighting is kind of, ugh, but I'm working on it, I promise you. Um, today I bring you my haul and the, the goodies that I bought. Um, I really wanted to get more stuff, but my budget didn't allow it. Some counters were really discounted, had really good prices, and some other counters uh, really didn't have a discount. The prices were still kind of up there. Uh, so let's begin. Now, first off, IMAX was tons of fun, tons, tons, tons of fun. Saturday was a eh day. Um, we just stayed there for like two hours, but Sunday we were there all day. It was such a great time. I met Nikki Tutorials. She's super sweet, gorgeous, super freaking tall. She's like about six feet tall. I met Beat Face Honey. She's gorgeous, beautiful, very nice, funny girl. I met Julie G. She's so sweet, beautiful. And she is as voluptuous as she looks in her videos, meaning when she does her outfit of the day videos. She is a very gorgeous woman. Um, we also saw the Queen of Blending, and she's, as always, super sweet. I was so, um, it was amazing that she remembered me from a class that I took, one of her classes that I took two years ago. And she was so excited that myself and my friend, Ms. Benzo, who went check out her channel Miss Benzo um we wore her I love makeup t-shirts in um it's like a purplish color lilac color and she was so excited she took a pictures of a, a picture of us we met Corin from Encore Makeup and he is so funny down to earth he's the type of person you can sit down and have great conversations with he is super funny so much knowledge to give out his class was great I love this class I learned a lot, learned a lot. Who else did I meet at IMAX? I think those were the, the big YouTube gurus that um, that I follow, that I, that I met there. But there were so many people there, um, so many different people from different makeup backgrounds that just has such fierce makeup on. And I took pictures with a lot of people and met a lot of great people. Everybody was super nice. It was awesome. Anyway, so I'm going to show you the goodies that I got. The first thing that I got that I'm really excited about is my, get it right here, my Bedellium Tools Mineral 10-Piece Brush Set. I've been wanting to try Bedellium for a couple months now. I've been, um, I like their page on Facebook and I've seen so many great things about their their um, their brushes, and I am a lip gloss hoe and a makeup brush hoe. I can there's no such thing as having too many brushes for me. And um, this set was actually forty two dollars, and it comes with the little brush roll, which is, I think is awesome. And I also bought three separate brushes besides buying the set and one of the brushes that I came in the set that I use today for this look is this dipple brush awesome super soft this uh, blush brush this flat kabuki brush that is super soft super soft and uh, this blending brush this brush is a great dupe for Max 217. I got that brush. Um, this is the uh, 769 angled contour brush, and this is the 781 pencil brush. I accidentally bought this brush twice because it came with the set, and I wasn't really paying attention, and I also bought it separate. And yes, their counter had great deals. And I bought this uh, brush. This is a great dupe for Max 219. This is Max 219. 
I will say this one is a little bit longer. But other than that, they look they're just the same. And this angled blending brush came in this set. This bra I, ugh, this brush I bought separate and it is a 949. This is a foundation brush. And I like it because it's like a cylinder kind of shape. Super, super soft. And that little squeaking you hear is my little makeup, my this thing right here, where I keep most of my brushes. And what else came in that set? This powder brush. And this awesome contour brush. And these brushes are super, super soft. Super soft. I love them. And this is a pencil 781 that I bought twice on accident. Love it. Love it. I think that's all the brushes that I got from the Delium Tools. Oh, wait. And this smudger brush. 755. You, what I think I bought this. Yeah, smudger brush. And I know I have... I know an eyeshadow brush came, a crease brush, but uh, I don't know where it's at. Somewhere in here. I have so many brushes that I, it's kind of hard to, to find sometimes. Anyway, when I find them, I'll show it to you guys. Another counter that we stopped by was a Cosette. I don't know if I'm saying that right. It is C-O-Z-Z-E-T-T-E. -T -T -E. And this is it right here. And I got basically a family of blending brushes. This is the large blending brush. This ugh, large blending brush. Medium blending brush. This is more like, like the 224. Just not as um, tapered out. Like this is... The Japanese to, um, brush, blending brush, and my, where is it, 224, I can't find it. It's in here somewhere, but it looks like the, basically the 224, and it is, they, these brushes are super, super soft, and this is a small um, blending brush, which is awesome to get into that crease for that definition. Or extra pop of color. Awesome brush. Love them. Another brush that I bought. And probably the only brush that I'll be able to um, get for now. Is a Hakuhoto brush. And it's a small smudger brush. Awesome. I love their brushes. But um, they're kind of... Um, they're expensive. But they're worth the money. If you are a working makeup artist, they're worth... The money but if you're not a full-time or even part-time makeup artist like working in the field like they're there they won't pay for themselves and you want to get stuff that pays for itself um, currently right now I wish I was a full-time working makeup artist but I'm not so I didn't buy any extra ones and I stopped by the velour lashes counter we stopped by there and these are lashing city and these were $20. And they look like this. Gorgeous lashes. You can use these up to 20 times. And um, the, the Cosette brushes were also discounted. I can't remember exactly how much I paid for them. Sorry, guys. And we stopped by the mud counter. And I got this six eyeshadow pen and two uh, a blush and a bronzer a contour and a blush and this was fifty dollars forty or fifty dollars and you get six shadows and the two cheek products and these are super pigmented I'm loving these products not chalky goes on smooth love it I also bought three of their um Lip glosses. Give me one second. I got this is an K 
Cupid. This is Bear. Is this Bear? Yes. Bear and Cantaloupe. And those were on sale too. I also got these two Lime Crime um, lip glosses that I've been dying to try out from the um, the carous they're called Carousel Gloss, and the top one is Cherry on Top, which is a pink one, and the bottom one is Candy Apple, and these are true to its color. What you see in the packaging is what you will get on your lips, like they are bam like in your face. Love it. Another product that I got was the NYX counter. They we were finally able to get through to the front of the counter because it was packed both days. And I got these two Caribbean Collection uh, palettes. And this one is I Dream of St. Thomas. And it looks like that. And I Dream of St. Lucia. Or Lucia, whatever. And I know I got something else from their counter. I don't remember what it was, though. No, I don't think I did. Uh, we stopped also by the Mayron counter. And I got these two shadows. This one is Fire Island. I know I got damaged. I'm so upset. Still good, though. And this one is in... Caribbean Breeze. They look the same in the camera, but one is more of a teal color and one is more of a greenish blue color. I have a thing for blue. And we stopped by the uh, eye candy counter and we I got this candy bag and I think it was $30, 20 or $30 and you get three gloss, three glosses, three glitters and the liquid sugar in there. And it comes with this little brush. And this stuff is freaking amazing. Like, I used to hate working with glitter, but now I just find an excuse to use this stuff to use glitter. This stuff is awesome. And the glitters I got is raspberry. It's like a dark red, like a black and red. This one is cotton candy. Or, <clears throat> excuse me, candy cane is a pink. <coughs> Excuse me. And this one is Gumball. It's purple. And the next thing I got were some Julie G nail polishes. Well, I'll put them, oh, I'll put them away. One second, guys. And I got this one. This one is Mermaid's Lagoon. And I have that on my nails. This is party dress. Girls night out. Which I also have on my nails. And beach baby. This is bright. Love this. And you guys are probably asking why I put this stuff away when I'm doing a haul video. I recorded this video like four or five times. And I didn't like the ones I recorded. So I decided to do it again. And I had to put the stuff away. So yeah. That's my fault. And I think that is it for everything that I personally got for myself. Again, I wish I had more money, but I spent money so fast that it was ridiculous. Like, it just disappeared. <laughs> but that's my haul, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And this is my makeup look. And I will be doing a video on this soon. If you guys have any comments or questions or concerns, please leave them down. Comment, rate, subscribe. Um, but yeah, definitely if you guys ever get a chance to go check out Aunt Matt's. Even if it's just for the classes and to meet people and just to walk around, it's a great experience. I'm, I'm glad I went. And um, if I forgot to show something, I'll just put it in one of my other videos. And on to my next video, I'll see you guys later. Bye.